bitterly cold air from Siberia has brought dangerously frigid and likely record-setting temperatures to the eastern half of the U.S. Temperatures are 20 to 40 degrees F below normal for February from the mid-Atlantic to the south. Schools in Chicago have closed and trains in the Northeast Corridor have been affected by the cold. Extreme cold warnings are also in effect in the Canadian provinces of Ontario and Manitoba. Frigid temperatures are expected to continue into Friday. Record lows have already been broken in Kentucky, where it was dash 8 F, 22 C, on Thursday morning in Paducah and most of state was below 0 F. Weather forecasters believe the cold air will help break more than 100 daily record lows, NBC News reports. In Atlanta, temperatures dipped to 15 F overnight and officials were trying to determine whether two people found dead had been killed by the cold. The extreme cold is also threatening electricity grids in Tennessee, more than 30,000 lost power on Wednesday and officials are calling for residents to conserve energy as the state remains in an emergency footing. Temperatures in the U.S. capital of Washington, D.C. are set to reach 2F, the lowest in 20 years. Even Orlando, Florida, was expected to see temperatures fall below freezing. The bitter cold comes after a series of severe snowstorms have hit the U.S. Northeast, with residents of Massachusetts and further north seeing more than 70 inches of snow within weeks, paired with sub-freezing temperatures. More snow was forecast for parts of northern Maine and Canada as well as areas around the Great Lakes.